So, did you watch opening day baseball yesterday? I did not. I was going to. Then I decided, no, I'm too tired. I'm going to bed. So, I went to bed. Oh, good for you. Yeah. Good for you. Well, you missed every player and coach on the Yankees and Nationals kneel before the National Anthem. Yeah, I saw it this uh, morning. I saw a clip of it. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. But it was before the National Anthem. So, I I did appreciate that they did it before, not during. Right. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, they've got all the creativity now of, you know, the Washington. I'm sorry. I was going to say the Washington Reds. The uh, Washington football team. <laughs> right. Yeah. Good uh, God. What a right. stupid. Are you kidding me? That's what you've come up with? And I know it's only temporary, but that's even that's stupid even temporarily. Yes, it is. The Washington <laughs> football team. <laughs> Plus, Jeez. you've ignored maybe the worst part. The Washington, you're gonna you're gonna call the team after a slave owner? How how is that possible? Thank you. Right? They should just be called football team, and then their jerseys should say "Kill the cops." <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's what America's that all head. about. That's what America's <laughs> that's what America's begging for. Oh yeah, just football team <laughs> and kill the cops. Uh, I think that's a really good one. Um, so did you did you see the the uh, ad from Fox Sports? Can we play this? You read the title cards, you know, in that sportscaster voice that you do. Here's the uh, here's Fox Sports. Listen to what they're promoting. No fans. Not on Fox Sports. Thousands of virtual fans. We'll attend Fox's MLB games on Saturday. And they're showing the digital fans are putting in the, wow. Wearing their team's colors. Yes, they'll even be doing the wave. Really? (laughs) He's got him. I mean. He had him at hello. They had you at hello, (laughs) didn't they? Yeah, they did. They had you at hello. It's probably better than leaving the stadium empty. It probably is. And, you know. No. Empty and silent is not good. It's just training us to stay at home. They're just training us to stay (laughs) at home and everything is normal. This is not normal. You know, at least in uh, in England, uh, the or I think in Europe, the soccer stadiums are empty too. Mm-hmm. But they're filling them with people like Osama bin Laden. And, <laughs> yeah, yeah, the cardboard and cutouts. I mean, that's, I think that's that's actually yeah, funny. I kind of like that. Well, you yeah. couldn't you couldn't get I mean, away with that here, though. People would go ape crap over that, right? I mean, you. Why did you use the word? Why did you use the word ape? Yeah. Uh, oh my gosh! Wow. The Wow. We were just talking about the Washington Redskins. <laughs> no, it and had then nothing to do with the Washington you, Redskins. Oh we're now talking gosh, baseball, if I'm even. not mistaken. But uh, Wow. Yeah. Ice. Offensive? Was I think that America offensive heard too? it. Yeah. It was very <laughs> offensive. To me, I'm apologizing to myself for even listening to you. I, I'm sorry, Glenn, that you listened to him. And, and uh, you forced me to listen. And I'm... I apologize. It's okay. It's okay. Just don't let it happen again. I won't. Okay. All right. So we're uh, we're good with that. Um, you really like the? Uh, I like it better the, than the, an empty the, stadium. I, yeah. I mean, I, I would I rather have real people in the stadium? Yeah. But I like it better than an empty stadium with no. So in other words, no you're noise. fine. You're totally fine with the coronavirus and and the hoax and the <laughs> yes, and that's the, I'm sure that's what America is hearing right now. Yes, I'm totally you're fine with this the virus. new normal. This new normal is good for me. Let's keep I'm good, it going. Guys. I'm good. Yeah. Yeah. Let's exactly. go. I could, we could have virtual businesses and virtual <laughs> restaurants, and I'm good. Just, uh, you know, hook me up to the Matrix now. That's exactly what I just said. I don't like it. I know. I know. We heard it. <laughs> yeah. Racist. Uh, the, uh, the problem is, is I don't like the normalization of everything. Well... Yeah, I know. Uh, I, I guess I guess I hadn't thought of it that way. That that we're normalizing, but I, I just want a feeling of normal during this time. And I know that's exactly what happens feeling. in a 
in a Marxist revolution, you don't care anymore. You just want it to stop and mm-hmm. you want it to go back to normal. Mm-hmm. And uh, so I mm-hmm. understand it. It's just something that you, Pat, have been been by, by my side, uh, mm-hmm. helping research and, and, and warning people. When we get there, don't do that. Yeah, but it's okay in sports. It's fine in sports. We <laughs> just need it. <laughs> right. Okay. All right. It. No, I no, I get it. Yeah. I get it. I get it. Uh-